everybody and welcome back to my channel y'all know how i do over here bulk recording all in one day while i got the energy and while i got this lashes and makeup on y'all know how i do but anyway if you are new here go ahead and subscribe to my channel i promise you will not be disappointed okay so as you can see you've already seen my first bath and body works haul with me and my niece so this is part two and i kind of got in a confession um it's going to be a part three to this because they also had another sale on their single wick candles and y'all know I had to do it. <laughs> so the first one was just a little um, of some perfumes we got, not perfumes, but the body mist and um, body creams that we had. But this one is going to be all on some sprays because they did have all their fine mist sprays for $5.50. So I spent a total of $48.05 on this and I bought how many items? This was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven items. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. This is going to be pretty quick. I'm just showing you guys some of my signature scents for the fall. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this first mist, which is the Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. This is my signature scent from For the Fall. I absolutely love it. And I do have the um, lotion to go with it as well. So I have my pair for the fall, which I'm super excited about. My aunt bought me that um, a long time ago. And I absolutely fell in love with it. I use, It's funny because I don't really like fall scents like this. But this one is it's a must have. I absolutely fell in love with that one. So next up, we have A Thousand Wishes. A Thousand Wishes is another one of my favorites for um, just any occasion, not the fall or the summer. I just really, really love this smell. I have the lotion to go with it as well, but I actually think I'm running out. But yes, so this is A Thousand Wishes. If you guys have tried any of these scents, go ahead and let me know down below which ones are your favorite or which, which is your signature um, smells for the fall and the... um the summertime so this one is cucumber melon y'all did not buy this for myself i bought it for my sister she loves cucumber melon me we grew up wearing this when i said grew up wearing i mean we had this all the time so i really cannot stand this scent anymore <laughs> if you know what i mean like when you grew up on something whether you ate something all the time or drunk something all the time you just don't want it anymore when you're an adult so this cucumber melon is not for me it's for her I literally cannot stand the scent anymore. And I used to love it when I was younger, but now I don't like it. <laughs> so next up is um, Gingham. I hope I'm saying this right. As y'all can see from the um, first Bath and Body Works Part 1, I did get the lotion to this as well. My mom also loves this scent. She has a few bottles of this and the lotion. Um, when I first smelled it, I got to be honest, I did not really like it. But when I got the hand cream, I was like, okay, I think I can get down with this. So it was $5.50. I could not pass it up. So next up, we have Beautiful Day. I got this one for my best friend. Um, I've never worn this one before. I never bought it um for myself i'm gonna actually see how it smells now oh spray on myself set in the top let me see this is so her spray is definitely her so i went ahead and bought this for her um and it smells really good so that's that and this one cherry blossom Okay, I went out on a limb and bought this one because I was like, well, I don't remember ever smelling this, but it looks like it'll smell good. I think I should have left this one on the website. Um, now that I got it, I'm not too wild about the scent. Um, so, it's not bad. It's not bad at all, but I do have certain scents where I just wear to bed at night because I don't really like wearing it out throughout the day. So I just wear it to bed. So this will probably be one of my nighttime scents when um, I'm ready, getting ready for bed. And last but not least, we have the travel size of the champagne apple and honey fragrance mist i bought this one for my niece because she absolutely loved this scent so i decided to get it for her i do have 
the this um in a bigger bottle and some lotion the um, body cream as well that's about it for this bath and body work haul part two let me know if you guys have ever tried any of these mists down below let me know what is your favorite bath and body work smell lotion is do you like the um the room sprays which are really good the candles so, yeah, let me know how you guys feel about this down below in the comments. Stay tuned for part three of this Bath & Body Works haul for some single wick candles, which I'm super excited to get. So, yeah, remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And remember, love it or leave it. Bye.